Okay, also I'm really sweaty. I just got back from my workout. I was gonna vlog before the workout because I have this whenever I first wake up, I'm like in a very chatty mood as we saw last week before I worked out. We chatted like in the car. Oh, Coco, no, no, I need to hold this. We chatted in the, no, no, don't touch it, please. We chatted in the car for like 15 minutes, but today also I have no makeup on, so please excuse me. Um, and I just like, I'm sweaty. My hair is like all gross. I tried to put my hair in a low bun, but it kept like fall. It like, well, first it was a high, but then it was a little bit, and I kept falling out, and I didn't want it to get creased, so I used this, like, little hair tie. Okay, by the way, it's just, like, housekeeping, so we're back. Like, we're back in business. I'm done with school. I finished all my projects. I finished my, like, all my intense work. I, like, I basically, the past, like, month would eat, sleep, work, like, school work, and that's all I did. Like, I had a huge, huge papers, right, like, huge presentations. Like, literally, the amount of work that I had in last month was probably, like, the most intense, hardest schoolwork I've had in my entire college career. And yesterday I took my last final in the evening and then I graduate tomorrow morning. And it's just, it's it feels surreal to me because like, I, I'll make, I'll make a video later. I think I'll, people want me to talk about college and stuff, but it was really difficult in the sense that I was like managing so many things like YouTube career and like a jewelry line, PB astrology, all this stuff. And I knew that I wanted to finish school to have um, just like, I just wanted to have my degree, you know, it doesn't, I don't think ink you necessarily, everyone's gonna, everyone, you don't need to like, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna like use it to like directly towards something. And does that make sense? Like be like, oh, this is a qualification for this. But I think that education is so important and like, especially if you're young and your parents are paying for it, or even if they're not and you can, but you can still make it possible. I just think it's really like such, it really, it, it's really important. I mean, it just teaches you so much aside from even like the things that you learn there it teaches you so much self discipline for four years to like wake up to go to classes to keep up to do the work to study for all the tests like that is a, so much self discipline like you know what I mean like to, to do all of that and to have the drive to do that and for me especially my first two years I was traveling a lot if you guys are watching I was like doing events all the time and yeah then I started like started like PBA and then Clyde and stuff and it was just it was really, really hard for me to manage and I had to like put, it was hard, like parts of my career on the back burner during school because I just had to finish. And that was probably the biggest challenge for me was like not, like, I don't know, let's say you have like a passion or something you know you want to do and you're not living it. That's like the vaguest example I can give. Like I knew what I, I was like, oh my gosh, I can't wait. I want to come up with designs and I want to talk about this and I want to do that. But meanwhile, I had to study for a test on East Asia. Like, do you know what I'm saying? Or like something that was like, I knew was so, I don't want to say irrelevant because that's not the proper term, but you get like in the moment, it's like, okay, right now I have like a business. Like I could be having like, I'm working with a brand on something. Like it would turn down brand trips like to go to New York with the brand or something because I had to work on like a class for like organizational communication like do you know what I'm saying and it was like so it was like so great something that was so I don't want to say like, but it were almost irrelevant I'd have to like put above something that would like directly impact me a lot of the times and yeah I mean I'll talk about it more if you want I mean maybe you guys got some specific questions it was a lot a lot a lot of work it was so much work it, but, but I mean, even like I, I can't. It, it's a lot of work just by itself. It's like that's all you're doing is college. But for me, I was like running my entire life and career while doing that. So it wasn't even my priority. Like when I I wasn't doing college, it wasn't my priority. Obviously, I was like getting everything done, and it was my okay. Like it was my priority in the sense that I'm not a slacker. I'm not. I like do well. Like I get good grades. Um, but it wasn't like my like what I live for. Like you know what I mean? Like if you're like in law school or something, it's like what you live for. Do you know what I'm saying? So. It feels surreal, honestly. Like I'm just like done. Like I don't have to go to class anymore. I don't have to like wake up and I don't have to like study. Come here, come here. I'll just say hi. Mm -hmm. You say hi. See, we say hi. This hair tie is from ASOS. I'll link it. I got these like cute little silky hair ties for one of my workouts. It doesn't like crimp um my hair. Um, but yeah, like it feels surreal. I don't have to like study for anything. Like I always felt like I always had to study for something or I'm like, no, it's like, I don't just have to do bullshit work. And that's like the biggest thing for me. Like I just, that makes me so happy. Like I can focus on what I want to love to do. And I'm going to be vlogging like literally five times a week. Um, Clyde's working on a new collection. So that'll be launching. I'm like I said, opening co coaching. I have what, three slots left for this upcoming week, two or three. And I'm pretty booked. Um, but you can, you buy it on my website and then I email you within three days. So if you didn't get an email and you bought it like the day, don't worry, like it's within three days. Um, so I'll be doing like coaching. I'll be 
I'm also, I've already a lot of guides on my website, but people were asking me to create more. I have like basic guides, like how to kind of transform your life, new moon, full moon rituals, just like general stuff, but I will work on new guides. Basically, like I can finally put my energy into all things us, you know, like, and that makes me so happy. And also uh, right now, obviously my priorities, she wants to, he wants to go play with Coco, she saw Coco. Um, also, my priority right now is finishing the apartment, which will probably take me like a month to do that. So I like, Basically, I mean, I just, I just got a coffee from Whole Foods because I also when I work out outfit, this is from also from Aloe. It has a slit here like this. It's actually really cute. And it's like a shiny, shimmery material. And it's like, they're a bit long on me because I'm 5'2", but like to get these are just, they're like 7, 8 length pants. Like the coral ones I have are the 7, 8 length and those are really good. Uh, but anyway, I'm, I don't, I could make my own coffee, but like my coffee filter, I don't have coffee filters, they're packed up. Like I haven't even unpacked because I've been just working on score. So my main priority is like, okay, to unpack. Also, um, to do like my bedroom. Um, the bedroom is actually supposed to come really soon. Like the tr tracking is updated, so hopefully it'll come soon. My mattress is supposed to come soon. So, and I have to put up prints in there. We'll do it all together. Like I'll do this all with you. But my priority now is to like get my home looking like, great and like what I want it to be. Today I'm actually, my game from for today, I actually have to like stop talking, I have to so go get ready is, I mean I just got home from my workout. Um, I'm about to go shower, get ready, meditate, and then I'm going to a lash film because I have my graduation tomorrow morning. And then I'm going to get a spray tan, <laughs> again for my graduation. And then in the evening, I'm actually meeting my dad at Ikea to get dressers. It's funny, like they're the ones I had my first apartment, I had those huge dressers and I ended up leaving them there because I was, was like not gonna, I was being like nice and was like, oh, we can, well, I, I wasn't gonna make a, the second room a closet, obviously, in there, so I left those there, but now I want those one same ones back. I do want a different structure in them, so it's fine that I left those, um, but I want like, I'm not sure you're talking about like the, the dressers, like you can pick how you want it. like you can have it all clothes you can have it like shelves and clothes you can like have it shelves and pull out you can have it like half shelf like you can kind of custom it so i want those different so i'm supposed to go to ikea with my dad today to get those i don't know like and then tomorrow that's basically my day today is like all those errands and then going to ikea and doing that i mean that that'll take like the entire day um but yeah like so this week we're going to be really focusing on getting everything together and obviously I'll show you all the decor and I'll link everything for you guys. I'm very chill about that. Um, I think it's cool to be inspired by something else. So yeah, like everything's in boxes still, honestly. Like once I have one, like everything, I don't, I don't think I've unpacked one box fully yet. Like that's how everything's in boxes right now. And to get like on a schedule, like I don't have any groceries or anything like that. So I need to like, my main focus was literally just like school. Like it was like no, no like nothing else but school. So like now I'm able to finally like unpack everything and put my clothes away and do the bedroom and I'm like I already know how I want the bedroom laid out and be able to get groceries and I have like also these like I want to take you guys to World Market I want to get like these like plates and I just have like all these like little like, I have like the big thing of decorating that I'm so excited to share with you I have all these like little things I'm doing that I want to share with you and I'm just excited to be back basically like we're back like that's it like you don't have to be like oh she's gonna come and she's gonna go you know what I mean we are like back in action. I'm really excited. This is just a hot coffee with coconut milk. Um, also, like I would, I want to make my bulletproof coffee, but all my stuff for it is in there. I even ordered case. Okay, so this is like life hack. So if you make bulletproof, or I'll teach you how to make it if you don't know yet. But I use this blender. It's literally a fifteen dollar blender, and it's like not good. It's like not good quality or anything, honestly. But like it's perfect for to make co bulletproof coffee. Like I'm not gonna be making smoothies with this thing. I'll link it from Amazon. But like it's just like this small white. Like okay, it's first of all very aesthetically pleasing. Also, my dad brought over a box cutter for me, and this has been. Oh, I just love that. Like, so sleek and slick and amazing. Like, it's the perfect thing. Like, okay, because I used to have, like, a big blender. Like, you know, like, a Vitamix type thing. Like, where and every morning I make bulk, I'd have to, like, take out this huge blender. And it was just, like, too chaotic for me at 7 in the morning. You know what I'm saying? Also, I'm getting on a different schedule. I'm going to wake up at 7, walk Mia, and then go to a workout. Um, instead of, like, waking up at, like, 7.30 and kind of taking my time. I'm going to, like, wake up, take her for a walk, go to a workout. Um... Because I want her to be on a schedule too with that. But yeah, it was like way too much at 7 in the morning. Like taking, you're like taking out this like blender and then you're like making, and then it's just like it's huge and you have to like wash it. It's just like so drama. It's like, it, it's just like, it's, I don't know, terrorizing almost. This like little thing, 
I discovered this blender actually because like a PR company sent it as like part of their like campaign for like a yogurt moisturizer and I really loved it and then I ended up leaving it or I don't know like I want to see like but I don't know like I'm I'm like the opposite of a hoarder. I'm like a, oh, whatever, I don't need it. Like my mom, when we were like, I was like, I was like, I don't need it, you can have it, I don't need that. Like, if I'm not using something and I'm not excited about it, I don't, I'm just like, mm, you know? Like, I guess it maybe got gross and stuff. Did it, are you any of you like this? Something gets really gross, you're like, well, that's canceled. Okay, but you see, it's honestly, Coco, no, I can't, I don't want you to knock this over. I love you, but you can't knock this over. It's so aesthetically pleasing, like it's just white, I mean, you know? And it, look, it's just easy, like, it makes the part so you literally to make bulletproof you like put your coffee in, you put all your stuff in you put the cap in you click the one button it's not confusing like you know when there's blenders have like you're like at seven in the morning i don't need that many options of blender but i need on that's all i on off thank you so this is like i'll link this it's like i said 15 dollars if you want to make like bulletproof coffee where this is like what you need to do because it's so quick. You have it on your counter, you pour it in, you click it, you open this cap, you pour it, you have coffee, no drama. Otherwise you're vlogging that whole thing out. Okay, so yeah, that's that. I wanted to share that with you guys. That was really important to me to share. Anyway, I'm gonna go shower, meditate, get ready. Hi, Koki. Do you wanna say hi? You guys haven't seen Coco in a bit. Do you wanna say hi? Hey, come on. She's, Mia's right now like on my knees and Coco doesn't want me to put her down because she jumps, she jumps on Coco, like you play, but sometimes Coco wants her space, you know? Um, but yeah, that's that. And I'll bring you guys along on the day. And yeah, like there's just so much exciting content coming. Like I'm not, cause I've like, I mean, just, I love like just watching someone move is always so exciting. Cause like you see so much fun home decor and then like I have, like just like so many cool things to share. So I'm so excited and yeah, let's do it. Yeah, so you're gonna go shower with mommy? I know you wanna play with Coco, but she just wants to chill for a little. She just wants to chill for a little. She just wants to chill for a little. Hello my marvelous people. So I, after my workout in the morning, I was kind of like literally rushed to do errands. Also it looks dark outside, it's three o'clock. It's been gloomy the whole day. Like it feels like it's seven o'clock right now, but it's literally three. Like, you know, you know, it's interesting. You know when you, okay, so like, I'm sure you guys have different schedules, certain days, you know how like you look back and you're like, wow, yesterday at this time, like I was only leaving to go take a final. Like, and it was like, my day was like starting in a sense. Cause I was just studying the whole day before. And so like yesterday, my day was like starting after like, I literally was just like leaving. Today it's three and I'm like, I woke up, I went to work out, I got coffee, I showered, I meditated, I got my lashes done, I got a spray tan, and now I'm headed to go meet my dad. So I told you we're going to Ikea because I need to get those dressers. Uh, also, all my clothes are packed, so like I've had to have been really creative with outfits. Like I have like seven pieces out and I've just had to like mix and match them. Oh, also I even, I got, I went, uh, I was so hungry. I, I'm doing like, okay, I, I intermittent fast by accident and I realized since I do it by accident, I'm just gonna make it a thing. Like I already only eat around noon because I work out in the morning and then by the time I get home and shower, meditate, like it's noon. Um, and like I work on stuff, like, and then I, I'm like just lazy to make food right away. So I've been intermittent fasting kind of by accident, but I do, like, it's like, and I do think it really works. Like, I honestly, I'm in really good shape, and I think it really, that, that is part of it for sure. But I also think that you have to have protein after your workout to build muscle, like, 100%. Like, if every time when I was doing those best but ever workouts and always having uh, a protein smoothie after, like, I 100% saw results. So, I don't know, it's like, I'm kind of torn. I don't want to advocate for either or. Like, if you're trying to lose weight, intermittent fasting works 100%. Um, so, you know, go for it. <laughs> it, it. Like, it will really help you, it helps sculpt you. Um, but also, like, if you're trying to, like, get toned I would still I don't know, maybe do like I guess it's kind of breaking the fast but I feel like I'm gonna work out how make myself my like protein smoothie I'll show you the one I make and then wait till like 12 to 1 to eat again or whatever it may be I don't know I'm kind of torn honestly I haven't made a decision but you know but sorry why am I like all over the place that was my logic I was thinking about that anyway so I'm meeting my dad why did I get to I just got like so lost in my own sentence sorry like I, my day's been like go 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 like i just like stopped at home right now i had 20 minutes to do my makeup i didn't make up in 20 minutes and like put a few curls into my hair and i like 
it's like not fully curled so i just put like the scrunchies also from asos i'll link it um in my hair it's like i tied it really lightly so it doesn't like leave an indent in my hair but yeah we're going because to meet each other because he's bringing the u-haul and we're gonna go get these dressers i'm really really excited i like haven't picked like i told you I know, I know i want a different style i have to like see it in person to pick it out so i'm really excited to pick that out um and i'm excited for that room to start getting started because right now like <laughs> all i have done in the place is like in my place is the like part of the living room like like a little part of the living room. I need to finish the living room because I need to unbox everything and then I need to decorate like the living room and then I like I need to do the two rooms. Like I said, like it's like all been on pause while I was finishing school. But I stopped at Erewhon. I got a green juice. I don't know, like honestly green juices are so overpriced. Like it's fine if you just like once in a while, but you can make it yourself. Like what's in this? Organic celery, organic cucumber, kale, romaine, dandelion, parsley. Oh shit, this man just like did a U-turn. Okay, no, it's my turn. What are you going? Um, but yeah, so I really, I really, why do I have this? I don't know, I just didn't have that much time so I just grabbed it to have as like a beverage instead of like a water almost, but literally make your own juice. I My juicer is packed up also in boxes. Like I'm not getting everything in boxes today. Actually, I was, Mia was chewing stuff, so I was like, oh, I need to get her her pull out, out of find out of the box is her like fake rawhide it's like a veggie version because rawhide's bad one of you told me that we all kind of talk about on instagram so she has these like faux hide i don't know whatever they're called i'll link them on amazon i'm good with links now i'm now i have no excuses this is like yeah I, this is, i'm doing it um so i will link those but i had to like find those for her because she was chewing like starting to chew random stuff around the place i was like holy crap she's never done that like I've never seen her start like chewing stuff around, like like she's trying to come up to the wall and chew it. Like I've never seen her get that wild. So I had to find those for her and I found those and then in that same box were my coffee filters. Now I can make coffee at home. Even though like, I, I talked about this in a different vlog, I actually didn't end up posting, but like sometimes getting coffee is like an experience for me. It's like less about the coffee. It's like, it's like part of start just like setting up my day to for the energy that I want, which I'll talk about later. But anyway, let's have a sip of this. Okay, I forgot these are like these peel off. Like you think that I was twisting this for 30 minutes? I was like, wow, it's really stuck. It's a peel off one. Like and it's like and it seals back by pressing it down like this. Like it's like you know. Oh, I, delicious. But my makeup, I'm wearing uh, Charlotte Tilbury's Pillow Talk lipstick with Charlotte Tilbury's Seduction Gloss over it. Um, my top is from Revolve. It's by Lovers and Friends. I'll link it. And this is from ASOS. I just like to answer questions because why not to answer it in the video? Beverly. Okay, well, I think we're going to go. Yes, this is what we're doing. I got sauce, bitch, I shine. Oh, this is like a really pretty street, I'll show you. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> when you can't put on copyrighted music, so you sing. This is Beverly Boulevard, if you ever visit LA. Um, it's like near the Beverly Hills Hotel. There's like a lot of these streets with like really pretty palm trees. So, take a look, enjoy. You know when like, it's like the left turner is really, um, Really get it going. I love this song. I don't know why. It's such a bad song, but you let me know school. You gonna let me hit the first night. Thank you. I'm gonna need my money like Okay, it's right now. It's my favorite part. Are you ready? Okay. What's it? What's it down? What's it down? What's it down? Why she come around? Bitch, you gotta bust it down. What's it down? What's it down? Okay, that's just like, you know, I don't know, like, there's like just parts of songs that are just like so, it, like, I like the drop of it, how it goes from like one beat to another, and then it's like, when my G come around, bitch, you gotta bust it down. And, like, I don't know why, like, I've always liked YG's music, like, genuinely, and I don't know what it is. It's so funny, like, um, last year he performed at, like, the Revolve uh, LA Festival, but I didn't get to see it because I had to go to better early because I had class the next day, and, like, I just feel like I will see him this year somewhere. Maybe at a coffee shop, maybe in concert, who knows, but I will see that man. Um, but yeah, I'm driving still, but I just wanted to show you that song. Also, I I started like making playlists again on Spotify, 
I make a new playlist whenever I feel like there's a new vibe and like literally I've made like four in the last week like whenever like I feel like a different vibe I'm like okay next playlist like I still go back to other ones like I'll still be like oh I want to listen to that playlist I like that one song or like the vibe of that or like you know sometimes you want a different vibe like sometimes you wake up and you're like we want that sometimes you wake up and you want like some I am affirmations sometimes you wake up and you want some like relaxing music like I have a play playlist called like she's so and then it's like a dove so it's supposed to be like she's so like fly you know free whatever whatever it's up to interpretation it's like art um and like that was like really relaxing in the morning and i also i love the song um it's called it's on that playlist too i mean that was really helpful but anyway my spotify is just my name helena baragova it's so funny i guess i used to mention my spotify a lot right like a few years two years ago or so but i like didn't know that anyone like care like i didn't know that people cared how people were asking to like find a song and then i was like oh like, i have like you guys are following me on there like it's a thing so i do i am on the spotify i also need to preserve the battery so we can vlog Ехать нормально показывать. Тан -тан -тан -тан. Мы выехали, она, она показала час ехать. Я. Yeah. А потом одна авария, она говорит, делай 30 минут. Но вторая авария, делай 17 минут. Она, мы проехали через Дантаун. Вау. Wow. Дантаун по 110. -й. Че ведь нажать нужно, нет? Yeah. Полина Берегова. Автор. Автор. Финишн школ. Almost graduated girl. A shell. It looks like a bunch of shoe shells. How do you know? How do you know if it's equal? What? Like how do you know if it's equal to this? Ah, there's I'm trying to think what I want it to look like. It's hard to conceptualize. Yeah. Okay. 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 I'm on my iPhone, so excuse the disgusting quality. Um, but literally, this was like the simplest process. So I told you I wanted those dressers, and I wanted to customize them, and I was worried it'd be really difficult because you can customize them into literally anything. Like you can have like, um, you can have like all clothes, like two levels of clothes. You can have it like be like a whole shoe rack. You can put in like dividers and have like half the clothes, half two bag, anything, right? Like. It's kind of wild, so it's kind of you need to kind of have a game plan. And I didn't have a game plan of how I, I didn't know how I wanted to organize it, and I literally just like did it on the spot in like five to ten minutes. And I like how it turned out. Like I did two closets with two rows of clothes. Um, then like one that's gonna be like all shoes, I think, and maybe bags. I don't even know how I'm gonna organize that. And then another one that's like combo. But I would definitely, if you're going to be getting the shelves. Um, like look online for some inspo or if you like the way I do it you maybe screenshot that so that when you go in the store and you customize it it's really quick and you like do it on a computer then it'll print out like a barcode of all the it'll like write down everything you picked out like the items and then it'll print out like a barcode you literally pay and then like I'm, we're waiting at furniture pickup and they bring it all out to you like I've we've I've been at Ikea maybe for under 20 minutes like I literally from the time I walked until now it's been less than 20 minutes and like I'm about to get the whole closet thing also you could they, they part of so it sounds like a brand deal, right? Like, I wish Ikea sponsored me, but, yeah, so, honestly, it was a very easy process, but I'm glad that, like, I figured out on the spot how I wanted the closets, because I, like, Uh, bubble bath, so we got from Whole Foods. 
I'm about to take a bubble bath. This bathtub is like this square bathtub. It's honestly a quite nice experience. Awesome. Thank you for watching today's vlog. I'm really tired. I have to go to bed early so I have to wake up at 5 in the morning tomorrow. I'll vlog tomorrow's graduation and building day. I love you so much. If you want to see like a first look at the dress and at all of that stuff, then follow me on Instagram. And yeah, I love you. So have some bookings open for coaching for those of you are interested and I'll all the links down below.